Let's take a look at some of the other stories happening around Metro Atlanta, starting with a slowdown during this morning's rush hour. If you saw some smoke near the interstate in Vinings this morning, this was likely the cause of it. A charter bus caught fire on I-285. People could see the smoke for miles away. The fire happened in the southbound lane, stopping traffic completely at one point. Then, of course, traffic slowed in the northbound lanes because everybody wanted to get a closer look. The driver was the only one inside the bus, and he did make it out safely. Tonight, we know that film and TV crews are planning a nationwide strike starting on Monday. The union says all 60,000 members will strike if the demands for fair and working conditions are not met. The move would bring all productions to a halt, including ones in Georgia. That strike is set to start 12.01 a.m. on Monday. Governor Brian Kemp announcing this morning hundreds of new jobs are coming to Midtown Atlanta. Tech company Cisco is opening a talent and collaboration center in the Coda building with a $41 million investment. Cisco already employs 1,000 people in Georgia. The three top areas where the company plans on hiring are engineering, customer experience, and finance. We'll have much more on this announcement coming up for you at 6 o'clock.